Hi, this is instructions on how to use your new e-cigarette. Right, first of all, this is the e-cigarette. Comes with the battery, which is this part, and the clearomizer, which is this part. This comes off by unscrewing it. Also, we have the charger. You can plug that into your computer, um, an external battery, or into a USB wall socket. You may have one with your mobile phone. You can also plug them into a car adapter as well. I've even recharged it using the car radio USB. Right, to charge your battery, I'm going to be using an external battery with a USB port on it plug it in, you'll have a green light on there, get your battery, now just gently screw it in until it changes to red, now that's charging, when it's fully charged that light will go to green um, and it will turn off automatically. So just unscrew it, never over tighten these. Now, how to fill your e-cig. Screw this back on. You can either fill it with it screwed on or screwed off. Now, you remove, unscrew this black top, like so. If you look down there, in the centre, you will see a an air hole. Now you do not want to get any liquid down there because that's what brings the air up from the bottom of the e-cig all the way up to the top. So to fill it up you take your liquid and you hold it at an angle and then you drip it down the side. The inside wall of the e-cig. Like so. And then you want to fill it up to the mark 1.6. So it's just under the, the white rubber grommet where the wicks come out from. And you put your top back on. Don't over tighten these either. And then that's it. Now, the activation of the battery, there's a five click safety feature where if you click it five times within two seconds, that will turn the battery off. So when you click it, nothing will happen. That's just in case you want to store it or you're storing it in the box or you're putting it in your bag just so that it doesn't ac accidentally activate. To turn it back on, you just click it five times, it will flash. Now that's on that's ready to use. I say if you leave it on the table or whatever you don't have to turn it off, it won't use any battery. Now uh, to take a drag you just press the button and hold it take your drag then release. With these cigarettes it's better to take a a longer and slower drag rather than a a normal a normal cigarette where you take a quick drag now if you accidentally do get liquid in that middle hole all you have to do undo it like so get some toilet paper or some kitchen roll and then blow through the top to remove any liquid like so. Also to maintain the battery every now and again just get a bit of toilet paper and put it inside there to clean it. You can see you get some dirt on there it just improves the contact between the battery and the atomizer. As you know, these atomizers 
can last anywhere from a week onwards. Um, I've had some that have lasted me three months. I've had some that within the first two or three days they've blown. And that's about it. Um, I hope you enjoy your e-cig smoking sensation. Thanks.